I say that because this was released one year after Oblivion, um, and it kind of tried to cash in on all the success that Oblivion had, so it advertised itself as the Oblivion killer. If you search that term, you'll find it. Um, it said it had a much bigger world, more engrossing quests. It had none of that. It's an awful game. I love it, but it's an <laughs> awful game. Um, we're going to play it on easy because we have to kill one or three characters. I'm also playing on the lowest settings because it makes you appreciate the game more. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, I'm going to get a quick introduction from my couch. Hi, I'm Dr. D. Chops. I am one third of the world record holders of the two worlds, three players, one keyboard mouse. Hi, I'm Albano Albatross. I'm the guy that controlled the movement keys in three players, <laughs> <laughs> one keyboard mouse. And I'm Alta Biscuit, and I pressed all the other buttons. <laughs> Congrats, dude. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I actually have the record for this category at exactly two minutes. Um, it's within a s one second of my sum of best, so it's very optimized. Uh, it will probably never be beat. If someone wants to beat it, go for it. It would be Ooh, great. All right, uh, we're going to get started. Timing starts when I skip this cutscene. Um, get ready for some really precise tricks. There's a lot of them. <laughs> and this takes about two to three minutes. There's n a lot that can go wrong, but we'll see. Uh, so we can watch this cutscene. It's like seven minutes, or we'll just start in three, two, one, go. <laughs> yeah. That's a skip. So this is two worlds any percent. Uh, if you just saw Oblivion a bit ago, you saw it beaten in like seven minutes. Uh, so the sewers, which is the tutorial area for that thing, took like five minutes, right? Well, we're done. That it takes twenty minutes for our nice. tutorial. Uh, up here, if you see on the top of the screen, it says go outside and find your employer. This is our employer right here. It wants us to talk to him. Uh, we're just gonna walk around him though. Oh my God! What a God! <laughs> That was amazing. Okay, uh, so we're going to have a little short walk here. While I'm doing this, I want to thank two people. I want to thank Durak, who did some routing for a different category of this game, and Straightburn, who also did some routing for that. Uh, and I guess Nick Nime, who kind of got me into speedrunning this and ran it at ESA last year. Uh, so coming up is a very important what trick. We this here? is a fence, and uh, we need to jump over it. Amazing. Oh my god. No animation, no yeah. hard fall. So if you actually screw that up, you will get an animation that'll lose you about a second. Uh, so why this game is so great is because the final boss of the game is right up here. It's this guy. You can't see me pointing. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so we're just going to attack him with a fireball, and then we're going to talk to this guy, because he can talk to us later. So this is the final boss. Uh, oh, I got bad luck here. We'll try to do it anyway. It'll be fine. So final boss, I might have to... I better save, actually. Just in case. Uh, he did attack me. Nice. Right, so go. I tricked him into throwing a fireball at me, and the fireball actually has splash damage. So the splash damage, if I stand close enough to a town member, uh, the splash damage also hits the townsperson. And it turns out that townspeople don't like that. They get super pissed off and uh, attack the final boss of the game for me. Uh, so this guy had... Oh, this is really bad luck so far. They are all missing their attacks. This might be overestimate. We'll see. Um, anyway, <laughs> so the final boss of this game is 40,000 health, which is actually quite a bit. Um, for reference, our sword attack does about 10 damage. Our fire attack also does, I think, 13 damage. So we can't kill this guy alone. Uh, but with the help of our buddies over here, we can. And we play this on the original patch of the game because there's a glitch where once this guy dies, oh. uh, the game ends. So get ready on time. Time. Oh my god. Yes. What a god. Incredible. Did you see that? I, I can't believe it. Oh Astounding my gameplay. My heart is racing. 224? 20, 226. Actually, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Uh, can everyone be quiet? There's a good line coming up here. I want everyone to listen to it and appreciate it before we end this. Kira? Also, that's your sister. We just rescued that her. That took a long time. That took a long <laughs> time. <laughs> all right, so that was Two Worlds. I uh, hope you all enjoyed it. Thanks for having me. But I feel better now. We shall find a place of rest. All right, so uh, I blinked and I missed that. Um, could you do it again?